Hello Aquarius and welcome to your February 2020 love reading. Let's get into it. I hope everybody's doing well. We finally got January over with. Yay. This is for Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And welcome back. Welcome if you're new. Remember the energies can be reversed. So, this could be whoever you're inquiring about also. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Alright, why don't we jump right out there. We got romantic feelings. Your feelings are worth exploring, or real and worth exploring. And you got, express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Okay. So whatever you're, whatever's going on with you right now, it's real and worth exploring and make the romantic gesture. Let's go ahead and clarify that. I'm going to get you um, an angel oracle and a hidden realm for advice. Ace of Cups, Queen of Cups. Got a um, maybe water sign in your midst. A lot of times I just lay these out, guys. But I'm going to let you see me shuffle them so you know. I am not just putting up stories. All right. Romantic feelings. What's going on with Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Okay. Somebody making an offer here? We got the Page of Pentacles. This is a message. Could be pertaining to... I'm here in a venture of some kind. Okay. You got a Leo in your midst or needing to have strength to get through whatever you're going through or to get up the gall to make this romantic gesture. Okay. So, so far so good. This is beautiful. Okay, we got Virgo, or we got the Hermit. This could be you needing to go within to seek the answers to your question. Because you have them. See? It's not a dark card. Clarify. Strength in the Hermit, please. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Okay, somebody's trying to get away with something. Could be a water sign, page of cups. Somebody might have broke your heart. King of Swords, there you are. Inner conflict about taking your own lead. All right. Pretty cut and clear here. Somebody's had some deceptive energy. They're not they're not expressing how they really feel about a possible page of cups or Pisces, Cancer Scorpio, but usually Pisces with the fish in the cup. Somebody that might may have broke your heart. This is you, Aquarius standing in your truth. With some inner conflict about taking the lead in a situation. All right. So, looks like there was past deception and some heartache about someone who made an offer. 
You standing in your own power now. With some inner conflict. And the hermit going within, seeking your answers about that inner conflict. And taking the lead in whatever this situation is. Okay? Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. We got the Six of Wands, your victory card. So, whatever this was, looks like you're overcoming it. Clarify the Six of Wands, please. Justice. Okay. So, this is either a Libra or you got justice in the situation no matter which way it worked out. Because you expressed your love, you got victory and justice. Yay. Lots of major arcanas here, Aquarius. Clarify, justice, victory. I, I mean, it's pretty, pretty self-explanatory there. Damn. Anything else you want to say? Hmm? Beginning and an end. So, this looks like a new beginning for an old situation that might have caused some heartache in the past. Because that's what I'm seeing. This was deceptive energy in the beginning, whatever it was. Possibly with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. May have broke your heart. There you are sitting in your truth with the King of Swords, three, three of three of swords, King of Swords, five of wands, inner conflict, fighting all yourselves about being the leader that you're supposed to be in the, in whatever the situation is, because it's it, it's a relationship. All right, and you will come out victorious. With justice and a new beginning more than likely an ending in a new beginning ending of an old way beginning of a new way <clears throat> excuse my voice guys I got a cold okay so all these major arcanas is telling me you got guys got some major stuff going on in your lives all right I'm gonna pull you an angel oracle and then uh, hidden realms and that'll be your read Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Anything? Oops, we got one turned up. Try to have to reshuffle those. All right, then. Where is Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? Cleanse and detoxify. With great love and respect, we ask that you detoxify your precious and sensitive body. As your, at your request, we'll help you develop life-affirming ways to deal with stress, as well as ease any sorrow at shedding your old ways. Give us your cares, worries, and give your cares and wor worries and concerns to us, and feel the beautiful grace of your newly purified body so looks like it's time to detoxify yourself from all toxic situations
So the hidden runes, when they come out upright, they are a ally in reverse, challenger, and some are dual cards, okay? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. in reverse wisdom power of the divine okay Okay, it's a challenger. So we got the well watcher comes to you to let you know that you've run out of steam. Self will alone isn't enough to make things happen. All cannot be yours at this time. If you feel you're going nowhere, it's because you're meant to stay put. Wilfulness can lead, lead to your becoming like a bull in a china shop, creating havoc at your as you push forward. Remember, the sacred creative source of the water in the well. Drink some, be still, and contemplate the true origin of power. It isn't you. So drink deeply of the wisdom of the divine and listen to the beautiful music playing through your life when you've made conscious contact with your higher power. You can now move forward again, replenished and renewed. This is also an important time to restore harmony in your relationship since you may be temporar temporarily out of tune with one another. If there's a power struggle between you, remember that only the divine has true power and you won't feel the need to struggle anymore. Okay? So that's your advice cards. Um, let me know if you enjoyed this. It's just a basic love reading. I hope you did. Please like, subscribe, and share if you did. And I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.